good morning and thanks for checking out these videos. Just a little encouragement for you today on your daily walk. The weirdest thing is happening with my Alexa, you know the little echo dot. I have it set up to go through this routine each morning. I say Alexa start my day and then she kind of tells me what the weather is and a fun fact for today and what happened on this day in history. She gives me the verse of the day and then I have her set to play Caleb our uh, national radio station that just plays positive, encouraging Christian music. And it's a fun thing. Uh, you should check it out. Set up a little system for your Alexa. And for whatever reason, I, I can't explain why, the last two days when she's gotten to that last step in the process, she doesn't just play K-Love radio, she plays K-Love Christmas radio. <laughs> and so for the last two days, here we are in August, uh, we're listening to Christmas music on our Alexa app. And so I just thought, you know what, let's go with it. And so my verse for today comes from what we typically think of as the Christmas story. Matthew chapter 1, verse 22, which says, All this took place to fulfill what was spoken by the prophet. The virgin will conceive and give birth to a son, and you will call him Emmanuel, which means God with us. And I know we're a little ways until Christmas, but we still need to remember that God is with us. He came to be with us. And I love the fact that throughout history, God just keeps getting closer and closer and closer. You look all the way back to Genesis and God is hovering over the water. Then you, you move to kind of uh, Moses and Mount Sinai and he's kind of there, but he's above the people and they can't really get close to him. And then God continues to, to be near the people in the tabernacle and in the temple, but still there's this distance and only one person can, can kind of approach and you have to do it just right. But in Jesus, God comes even closer than all that. He's not just above us or near us, he is with us. And whatever you are facing today, whatever comes your way, please know, please remember that God is with you. He is Emmanuel. He's come to be with us so that whatever we face, we don't face it alone. And isn't it so true that, that when someone is with you, the good times become a little bit better and the bad times become a little bit more manageable. And that's my hope for you today, that God's presence with you would amplify your joy and would bring comfort to any sorrow that you're facing. So just remember, whatever station you're listening to, whether it's a regular radio or Christmas radio, just remember today that God is with you.